Hello everyone. In this video, let us solve one problem that involves the concept of local minima and local maxima and also the concept of global minima and global maxima. The stock price P of a company depends on time T as P of T is equal to 0.2 t power 5 minus 3.75 t power 4 plus 25 t cube minus 72.5 t square plus 84 t plus 40. So this means that P of 1 is the price of the stock after 1 hour and P of 2 is the price of the stock after 2 hours like this. So P of T is the price of the stock after t hours. Initially, at t is equal to 0, the price of a stock is rupees 40. Suppose, Suraj wants to buy a single stock of this company at the lowest price. Find the best time for Suraj to buy the stock. So, simply, we have to find the value of t for which this p of t attains the minimum value right so it is basically we have to find the point of global minima of this p of t which will be the best time for Suraj to buy the stock okay let us find the critical points of p of t first we have p of t given like this so we compute p dash of t by differentiating with respect to t and equate it to 0 to get the critical point. So, p dash of t will be equal to 5 times 0 0.2 t power 4 minus 4 times 3.75 t cube plus 3 times 25 t square minus 2 times 72.5 t plus 84. Further simplifying, we get t power 4 minus 4 times 3.75 will be 15 t cube plus 75 t square minus 145 t plus 84. Now, you can actually plot this polynomial on Desmos and identify the points at which it touches the x-axis or use the trial and error method to find the roots of this polynomial equation. Okay, so let us try to plot this polynomial in Desmos and find the root. So this is the graph of p dash of t. So if you see the graph touches x axis at points 1 comma 0, 3 comma 0, 4 comma 0 and 7 comma 0. Hence t is equals to 1 t is equals to 3, t is equals to 4, t is equals to 7 are the roots of the polynomial equation t power 4 minus 15 t cube plus 75 t square minus 145 t plus 84 is equals to 0. So, we got roots as t is equals to 1, 3, 5 and 7. Right? Hence, the critical points of P of t are, so these are the critical points critical points of P of t are t is equal to 1, t is equal to 3, t is equal to 5 and t is equal to 7. Now, let us compute P double dash of t at these four points and check the sign whether it is positive or negative. Okay. So, P double dash of t will be equal to 4 times t cube minus 3 times 15 t square plus 2 times 75t minus 145. If we further simplify, we get 4t cube minus 45t square plus 150t minus 145. Now, p double dash of 1 will be 4 times 1 cube minus 45 times 1 square plus 150 times 1 minus 145. This will be equal to 4 minus 45 plus 150 minus 145, which will be equal to minus 36, which is less than 0. That means, t is equals to 1, 
is is a local maximum let's also compute p double dash of 3 we get 4 times 3 cube minus 45 times 3 square plus 150 times 3 minus 145 this will be equal to 4 times 27 will be 108 minus 45 times 9 will be 405 plus 150 times 3 will be 450 minus 145 this will be equal to 8 so this is greater than 0 that means p is equal to 3 local minimum similarly if you check for p double dash of 4 and p double dash of 7 we get p double dash of 4 as so just substitute 4 in place of t here we get p double dash of 4 as minus 9 which is less than 0 so t is equal to 4 is a local maximum and p double dash of 7 if you compute we get 72 which is greater than 0 so t is equal to 7 is a local minimum okay now we have got two local minima points so t is equal to 3 t is equal to 7 out of these two points which one will be the global minimum okay just check the function value at these two points and whichever is the minimum then that point will be the global minimum so let's compute p of 3 will be 0.2 times 3 power 5 minus 3.75 times 3 power 4 just substitute 3 in place of t in p of t so use calculator compute this value we will get finally 59.35 similarly if you compute p of 7 we get 8.15 hence out of these two points p of 7 has the minimum value which implies that t is equal to 7 is the global minima which says Surat should buy the stock after 7 hours so we have to find the value of t for which p of t is minimum right we have got t as 7 so Surat should buy the stock after 7 hours ok let us visually look at the graph and analyze so if you plot the graph of p of t this is how the graph looks like and if you see here at t is equal to 7 the function attains the minimum value so it is the global minimum but if you see at t is equal to 3 within the smaller interval in this region this function attains minimum value here so that is why it will be a local minimum but not global minimum finally i would like to conclude this video by stating the point where function attains the minimum value is called as global minima and other points where f dash of x is equal to 0 and f double dash of x is greater than 0 are local minima similarly the points where the function attains the maximum value is called as global maxima and other points where f dash of x is equal to 0 and f double dash of x is less than 0 are local maximas. Thank you.